Florists really throughout the country have been thriving through the pandemic. Flowers connect us to our loved ones. Uh, we can send flowers when we're thinking of them, when we miss them, especially now when we're not with them. A flurry of flowers, snipping stems, arranging roses, tying it together with tulips. St. Valentine has not taken a pandemic break this year. At Central Square Florist in Cambridge, it has been brisk. Compared to 2020, Valentine's Day to 2021, we're looking at about double. And we mean literally as well, with the challenge of freezing temps all week and the need to keep all of those arrangements under wraps. You cannot leave them outside. So that's making our deliveries tricky. We can't leave things at people's doors. Um, and we have to wrap everything in plastic in hopes to keep some warmth in the flowers. But there are some changes. For one, there aren't as many workers as they normally have or they need due to spacing. And on a normal Valentine's Day, there'd be a line down the street. Now it's scheduled pickups with very few walk-ins. Samantha, 10 o'clock. But if there was ever a time to tell someone you care through flowers, this might be the year to spread that love. I'm not really a big Valentine's Day person, but I felt like this year, since it's all so distant and kind of felt like I should do something more. In Cambridge, Josh Brogadier, WCVB News Center 5.